First of all, this is made by a plant called Rufa. Uh, it is invented by a farmer who is also the young farmer representative in today's assembly. And what he made here is the decoration and the shape of this is like a rice farm or a rice granary. Rice granary, if you keep it in the house, it means uh, abundant prosperity, abundant welfare, abundant blessings, abundant production. Okay, so whenever you have it or you receive it as a gift, and then that's the that's something you have in your life. So it's a very good super uh, souvenir for tourists or for uh, consumers. Okay, to take home. And this is the soap made by the plant Lufa again. So. Uh, because now consumers are so concerned about the chemical or taxing, but this is a very natural, chemical free, taxing, residue free. So it's also very environmentally friendly. And this is also uh, the product of farmers' creativity. This is uh, the lotion ladies can use, but it is also made by the plant lufa so again it's very natural and chemical residue free so you don't have you don't uh, smell very strong fragrance like like perfume no it's very natural so it smells very um, a, a little bit natural um, atmosphere okay but you will keep your skin very soft and very smooth okay And this is Chinese tea leaves. The difference is the coat here. Uh, when a consumer is concerned about the, the production, he wants to know how this tea leaf was planted. He can use his cell phone, his smartphone to sense the coat, and he can trace the products, um, the production process, and where it is produced. Also, this producer's record. So actually, this coat represents the products birth identification okay it, it is verified by a few of our academic institutions in Taiwan and this is a, a Nuga, Nuga candy Nuga candy this is uh, made by our dairy farmer and why he wants to make this is because he has, uh, he has his own farm, his own uh, pasture, but when he wants to attract a tourist to his farm, it's impossible for you to bring the, the milk home. So what, what he does is to uh, transform the milk into candy so the tourist can bring the candy home, sharing with his family members and friends, and also keep the, the memory of, of it, okay? Sorry, it's empty. Does everyone take it already? Okay. So basically, what we are trying to do is we transform and transcend agriculture uh, from the simple produce into profitable products. Also, add more uh, cultural sense into it and combine with uh, customers or tourists' daily life to make it like a souvenir for them. Also, increase the farmers' earnings by this way.